We're first going to look at the two most common syllable types, closed and open. The first most common syllable type is the closed syllable type, and it has a single vowel and ends in a consonant. That single vowel is always short, and so in this word, the vowel would say ah, and the word is not. In an open syllable, it also has a single vowel, but there's no consonant at the end. The single vowel ends the syllable, and it says its name, O, and the word is no. Let's look at another example. Here's another example. This is a closed syllable because our syllable has a single vowel and ends in a consonant. This word would be him. If we open up the door, now we have an open syllable, still a single vowel, but no consonant at the end. And the vowel shouts out its name and says I, and the word is hi. You can even have the children or your students make these unique houses with different material. Um, you can have them put their closed syllable word, like bed, for example, on there. Um, sometimes we tell the students that this vowel, all it wants to do is run out the door and shout out its name. But in a closed syllable, the consonant is blocking that vowel in, and that vowel has to remain short, and the vowel says eh, and the word is then bed. But in an open syllable, when we open up the door, the vowel can now run out the door and shout out its name, and it's going to say E, and now our word is B.